Our channel today, isn't it? Yeah. Luna says hello. Lottie did, but she's run away now, so I'm gonna put Luna down as well. Would you want to cuddle? <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> oh, oh, my Elvis. Oh, oh. <laughs> oh, you're so cute. Look at this flicky. Wow, it's because I'm thing going on. So is yours. Okay, so in today's video, it is a very exciting video. Don't know if you can tell. I think this part of your head is really excited. Um, we are actually decorating for Ooh. Christmas 2020, which we're so excited about. A lot of people, I feel like I've given us stick because we're putting our tree up before December the 1st. I know, who would give people stick for that? <laughs> Bradley. <laughs> oh my hair. <laughs> Oh, it's so cute. Look, do that. <laughs> See? Perfect. No, but you need to, like, you don't understand, like, the bangs have to come out a little bit here. I don't even know what a bang is. That I can't be able to explain to you. So, yeah, we are decorating today. Please just ignore this bit of hair because it's just doing its own thing today, apparently. I should put an ornament on it. It's like a Christmas tree. You meant to laugh at my joke. <laughs> <laughs> I laugh like Santa. <laughs> Christmas, you get it? <laughs> Do you want to tell everyone your poo story? No, that's not funny. <laughs> that completely gets him out of his like happy mood. Anyway, oh my god, four minutes. So yeah, we're going to decorate for Christmas today. That's literally all we needed to say. Over there, which we'll show you in a second. It's half decorated. No, we put the tree up yesterday. Um, but we haven't decorated it yet because it's just a faff doing the tree. You've got a hoover it. We've got a snowy tree and it was literally like it Real snowed. Snow. It was basically like it snowed in here because it was I was covered in fake snow. Um, and then our dining table is full of decorations and we're going to decorate. We've got a tree to do. We've got diffusers <laughs> and stuff to put up. <laughs> we've got our wreath to put up. Um, we've got garlands. We've got a, what, what's he called? The nutcracker. And That's we've what got they're really good food to eat. And we've got really good food to eat as well. So it's all good. Um, so if you want to decorate for us for Christmas 2020, then please keep watching. Come now. It's cold again, but I know we'll be warm sitting by the fire and dreaming.
to peace and silence on a very special Christmas Eve. Okay, so you just saw me unbox the most beautiful delivery. Um, I did treat myself, but I think I took it a bit too far. But it's okay, because it's Christmas. Nearly. <laughs> um, so Bradley has just really kindly made us some breakfast. Um, we've got bacon and egg bagels and orange juice. Um, Bradley's sitting there because this one's in his place. <laughs> and you're the princess, you need to take over, don't you? She is so tired. Are you a tired little moo? And Lottie just sort of struts around doing her thing. See so ya. Yeah, you're a bit, oh my goodness. You're a bit sleepy. So we're just gonna eat this and then we can decorate. Oh, sneak peek. Okay, I've got my new slippers on. This is our tree and our lovely fireplace. Um, our tree is from Argos. It's a seven foot one, it is pre-lit, but last night I just added another layer. Um, but I just wanna fluff it up a little bit. That's Bradley's job though, he needs to do that. Don't you? Yes. Um, and then this is our coffee table, which as you can see, coffee table? dining table which as you can see is very full of Christmas decorations um we've got our stockings here which have unfolded a little bit these are literally from Matalan um, and they're so lovely I get my stockings from Matalan every single year and um, they're only nine pounds as well um, and they're really lovely so I'm going to put these on the stairs as weird as that sounds I've seen loads of pictures and stuff on Pinterest and they look amazing. Um, so we've got like little signs, don't mind the puppy stuff over here. We've got a couple of wreaths, we've got garlands, we've got candle bits, ornaments, a glass. Who's the culprit for this then? Catch. Oh. <laughs> we've got a sleepy puppy. And um, we've got a new throw because, I mean, new cushions and a new throw from Next. Um, I'll try and link everything that I show you in the description box down below. But basically, I shopped in Argos, Matalan, Next Home and The Range. They're the four shops that we shopped in. Like table centerpiece is from The Range. And we've got eight hour burn candles. Um, this is actually from TK Maxx a few years ago. I think three years ago now. A little snow globe. Um, next sense, my nutcracker, how cute is he? And then these in this box is for ornaments for the tree, like baubles and stuff. Um, my little house. So yeah, this is what we've got to decorate with today. Um, I'm excited for our new throws and cushions as well. Um, and then obviously this will need a little bit of TLC as well. But we've got a little sleepy puppy. I'll get her nice and cosy.
make a wish upon a star Would it be too much to ask? Hello. Are you ready to show them? Yes. The end result of us working hours. How long has it been? We've been doing this for? Like 17 hours. It's been, what's the time? 10 past two, about four hours. You ready? The diddly 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 magic okay so let's start off in the dining area um this we've still got our normal table obviously um we've had to push it this way annoyingly because of this little one um and obviously she needs her little pen it's like her little safety place so we keep that there and um, the only thing that's changed here is the old autumn wreath we've just added because i don't want to chuck it um, I just don't think there's any point. Um, and then this really lovely like garland centerpiece. This was from the range, and I think it's absolutely beautiful. Um, I have got a table runner, which I might put up soon, but I think for now I like that. And then over here is our tree. We're still waiting for our tree skirt. I ordered one from Next. Um, it hasn't come yet. I ordered it ages ago, but it's saying it's dispatched. So hopefully I'll show you guys that very soon. If not, I will show you on my Instagram page because I always show you guys things like that. Um, the baubles, to be honest, this year we've kept it quite simple. We literally wanted it to be very white and bright, but not like too much going on. Um, and I love it. So majority of the baubles are from Net. Um, so like these ones are from Next and then these really beautiful ones are from The Range um, I feel like that's the only place we got them Next and The Range I think it is, if there's any more I'll pop them in the description box but I think that's yeah what we got all of them from um, I got little cute berries and then I also bought some organza, you can literally just buy this fabric on Amazon or Ebay and it comes in like a roll as you would have seen me and Bradley put it up um, so yeah this is our tree and I'm so happy and then our little star is from the range as well, it lights up. Yeah, this is our tree. Um, and then over here, these are sort of messed up a little bit. This is a winter diffuser from the White Company as well. We've got a big winter candle. This, I honestly can't remember getting this. I feel like I've had this for a few years, so I don't know where it's from. But it's like a little deer. We've got a little Noel sign there. A little house here. I should have put another light in the actual wax melt, but... I do feel like that looks really cute. Okay, please excuse our messy garden. Thanks to Bradley, he mowed the lawn the other day, but left the actual mower there and his crocs there. Bradley, what do you have to say for yourself? He's snoring. Um, so yeah, sorry about that, guys. I've asked him to move it. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Do you wanna go out? Do you wanna go out into the messy garden? So we've got our stockings hung up here. I love them. They're from Matalan. And then we've got some lanterns. The actual lanterns are from the range. And then the candles inside are from the White Company, which are so cute. They're like their new ones this year. Okay, and then over here is the cozy sofa. So I got a new throw um, and cushions, one there and one there. They are from Next Home. We want to get new big white ones, but it's so hard to find them that size. But these are just so discolored and horrible. We wash them all the time. But yeah, they're just like old now. So we do need to replace them. Um, and then I've got the original sort of furniture and stuff that I've had before. I'm over here. Okay, I accidentally took the fire off. So Bradley's putting the fire back on. But on the coffee table, I've got the new winter diffuser here. Oh, this is the most beautiful scent. And then I've also got the candle. Weirdly, you have to buy the lid separately, which I don't really understand. But I feel like it looks naked without it. I like it with the lid. So I've got the lid as well. Um, and then this wreath is from Tony Dunn Flowers, by the way. So it is so beautiful. And then up here, I feel like we've gone all out this year. Um, I've got a little oil slash wax burner here. That's from Next. Um, all of this is actually. The little house is from Next. How cute is this? It was only £20. Um, and then the little stars from Next as well. Oh, I love that. And then up here we have a wreath. This is from Matalan. I feel like it really goes with the sort of aesthetic in the lounge. And then on the bathroom door we've got, is this mistletoe? Correct me in the comments if I'm wrong. Um, but yeah, this is really cute. This is from the range. It's meant to go on your tree, but I thought it looks cute like on your door. Um, and then over here, obviously there's no radiator underneath, but we sort of use this more as like a little table shelf sort of thing. 
um, are prints are still autumn ones. I've tried to find Christmas ones, but I can't find them anywhere. So I do need to change these, I'm well aware. Um, our little light up house, it's literally just got a light in. That is from, I think it's from Next. Um, and then we've got a diffuser here. And then, yeah, it's like a ski lodge, it's called, from Next, which is cute. And then in the downstairs bathroom, we've got a little diffuser here from Next as well, which smells so cute and Christmassy. On our kitchen window, we have this really, really cute snow globe. I got this from TK Maxx, I'm gonna say three or four years ago. Um, but I feel like it looks so cute. And then this is literally, I'm just, in shock with this so this is one of my christmas wreaths this year and it is from tony dunn flowers i will tag his instagram down below because oh my god it's just beautiful um i feel like the color isn't really picking up is that better yeah i feel like that's so much better you can see like the gold um and look at these it's just so cute but like christmasy how stunning is this so go and give him a message on instagram if you are interested and then this is our wreath on our front door, which looks cute. And then my favorite part, I think, this is our little nutcracker. I love him. And then this is our stair garland. Oh my God, you guys, I actually can't believe it. This is like my dream. I love how we've gone a little bit more like traditional with it. And I just, oh my God, I think it looks so pretty. Um, so the actual garland, we've got three of them. They're from Argos, um, and I think they were £25 each. But then I think when you buy it once, then obviously you can have it in your garage or your loft, and then you can reuse it. Um, so I feel like you definitely get your money's worth. And then I literally just bought this, I've forgotten what this fabric's called. I'll leave it in the description box. Um, but I wanna like cut these, I think, a little bit better. Um, but I just put little bows on it. And then this is my old wreath, which was on the door there, but that one's obviously replaced it for now. So I just put this one here. So yeah, that is everywhere we've decorated so far. Um, I think that's gonna be the main part of it. I don't think we're gonna really decorate anywhere else. I'm not too sure. But I just wanted to show you guys this incredible delivery that me and Bradley have just received. And I can't, I'm, li I'm so excited. So you guys know, if I ever need a grazing platter, I go to Antipasto by the Sea. So if you're from around Brighton or they do deliver further, then give them a message on Instagram because they are honestly incredible. Are you ready? Da -da -da -da. So they have given me and Bradley two incredible platters. So this is a dessert one, which, oh my God, looks amazing. And then this one in here is their new Christmas hamper. How insane and Christmassy is this? I literally can't get over it. Oh my God, look at a little mini ice fruit cake. There's just so much stuff in here. And honestly, we are beyond excited. So this is definitely gonna be our dinner for tonight and dessert. Um, so I'll show you guys when we sort of dish it up and we'll have it a little bit later. But I just wanted to show you and just say a massive thank you to the girls at Antipasto by the Sea because this is honestly incredible. Like. Oh, I can't get over all of this food, it's just insane. So thank you so much. Okay, so I am now in my kitchen. Look how cute the stairs look, I can't go. So it's been a little while since I spoke to you. It is now pitch black outside, but to be honest, it's pitch black at like three, four o'clock now. And I thought it'd be really cute for us to do this together. I thought we could do a little gingerbread house. Um, I literally picked this up from Amazon um, and it comes in a little kit like this. Obviously the gingerbread is pre-made because we're not very good at things like that. But I'm very excited to decorate it. Brandy went to Tesco. So this is like the kit. Um, so I think this is the icing. It says you're meant to like, what's the word? Like mould it with your hands, like warm it up a little bit. Um, so yeah, that's the icing. That's the gingerbread, obviously. Here's some more icing, but I don't think we'll use that because I've got others. We've got some Smarties, some little snowflakes, me and Bradley, <laughs> and hundreds and thousands, which I don't think I'll use because Bradley went into Tesco's and picked up these, which are obviously more my colors. Um, and he's got red and green food coloring. I don't know if we'll use them yet, but it's good to have. We've also got a piping kit. Um, pick these up in case you know they're just an utter fail and we want to pretend that we've done these 
And then these, these are meant to help when you're, to be honest, these are cookie decorating things, which is why I've got stencils there. So these are actually cookie, like gingerbread sort of things to help with the icing, to like spread it out. Um, but I didn't make cookies. I was going to, but I thought, to be honest, this is enough. And we've got all this food, which is just crazy. So yeah, we're definitely not gonna eat all of this today, trust me, but it's just fun to do. And I thought it's cute and Christmassy and we can all do it together. Okay, who wants to see the big house reveal? <laughs> Bradley's just filling up my water bottle. <coughs> These are really nice to pop, aren't they? Mm. These are the ones I got from Cherries, if you've watched my latest clean with me. These are so good. Anyway, three, two, one, ta-da! <laughs> this is our gingerbread house. Sorry, am I being too loud? <laughs> This is our gingerbread house. Look how cute. I'm not gonna lie. It was so much harder to do than I thought. Like, ridiculously hard. Um, but we had a lot of fun. I say we. You participated in it for about 0 0.3 seconds and then he left. I did all the icicles. You did not. I done the icicles. This is what Bradley done. And apparently it's a Liverpool kit. And apparently I'm getting married. So, how do you feel about that? <sighs> <laughs> and I'm not. The room looks great. The mess was ridiculous, wasn't it? Yeah. I think yes. we spent longer cleaning than we did actually doing it. But it was so much fun. I'll pop a link to this exact one in the description box down below. I really recommend it. Really, really, really like doing it. We bought like the extra decorations and stuff from Tesco's, like I said. Um, but yeah, honestly, it's so fun. And this is really good because it helps it hold together. I thought it was just going to collapse but it literally held it so well together. And yeah, I don't wanna break it now, it looks so cute. So this is it. Bradley's just putting on the wax melts. Oh my God, how cute are those? <gasps> they look so cute. So there's one here. Oh, ribbon, oh lovely. Um, Couple there. Got the Christmas tree. Oh, it's just, honestly, I can't even begin to tell you how happy this makes me. I'm so happy. We're watching a film called Midnight at the- Magnolia. Magnolia. Um, cute, cheesy film, isn't it? Very cheesy. Very cheesy, but very, cute. Very and then I've got my two cheesy. fur babies here. We got a new throw and they absolutely love it. Look at Luna, oh look at her little paws. Oh my God, she's so sweet. So are you Lottie, you're such a good big sis. So yeah, we're just gonna chill here and watch the film. Yes. And then we've got the platter and stuff when we're feeling a little bit hungry and our gingerbread house, which is there. Sorry, by the way, for Luna's mats. And it, it should be like a normal thing because she's a puppy, but I feel like some people might be like, Ugh. do you know what I mean? But I suppose that's where she goes to the toilet because she can't go outside yet. But yeah, anyway. <laughs> she's too little. Nice she's too little. and cozy. Let's go outside, the snow is falling down And every child is having so much fun The snowman is twice the size as me With a smile as quirky as mine We're holding hands to keep each other warm While we stand and watch a choir perform And all the Christmas songs that we love Yeah, all the Christmas songs that we love and then while we're gonna go inside and drink our chocolate by the fire Cause all I want is to spend this day with you Let me give you a Christmas 
moment we'll fill with love and joy Mm-mm, so beautiful Kissing on a mistletoe's baby with you I don't need any presents As long as I spend this day with you Mm-mm, so beautiful Kissing on a mistletoe's baby with you Right, we are going to end the video off here because What's the time? It's like nearly 11 o'clock. Yeah, 10 um, to 11. We've nearly finished the film Daddy's Home 2, which is like a Christmas film. Are you okay? Come on then. Lottie's crying. It's okay. She's so good. I, me and Bradley were saying, obviously having a puppy, you need to teach them everything. But Lottie is so well behaved, but we didn't realise how well behaved she was until we had Luna, because obviously Luna's a puppy and you have to teach them everything. But... She's just good, isn't she? Like, yeah. asking to get up on the sofa, and if she needs a wee, she'll just literally wait by the back door, and she just... doesn't bark or anything. She only no. barks when the door goes, doesn't she? Yeah, only if I get deliveries, which, to be fair, <laughs> it's quite a lot, but... You're so good, aren't you? And you're such a good big sister. She's just so sweet. Anyway, <laughs> we are just absolutely shattered. Um, it's been the best day ever. We were saying we look forward to this day every single year and it's just it's sad that it's over but i'm also gonna appreciate yeah, but now you've got christmas to look forward yeah to, exactly you? like i love waking up every morning turning your christmas lights on and yeah i'm excited yeah, be, nice. be really nice I'll, I'll link as much as i can in the description box down below in case you wanted to pick anything up are you crying still are you crying are you crying you're a good girl but yeah, thank you so much for watching today's video. We hope you enjoyed it. Look at my wake up, it's just basically come off. Um, but yeah, we love you so, so much. Thank you so much for watching. <laughs> um, yeah. I'm so tired. Sorry, you've got such a big head that it's really it difficult. It's quite big, isn't it? I don't think this did me much justice, this so angle. <laughs> I need to go and shower and get ready for bed. Um, but we love you so much. <laughs> Freddie's asleep. And we will see you guys on Tuesday for, I think it'll be um, Pamper routine. Ooh. Hope so. I'm filming it tomorrow, so I think it's Chris. Oh yeah, Pamper. Right, we love you and we will see you then. Bye. Didn't do it? Over and out. <laughs>